and welcome back to the last video I'm pre-recording today as I still have time. Uh, Land Decor video, and this one comes to us from, oh God, is it Nick Nicholas Thomas, or I think it's Nicholas Nick Thomas. You asked the question, which Land Decor do I think Luigi belongs into? Now, as you can note from the uh, picture here, Luigi, even though he does pull his weight to some degree in the Mario series, is a bit of a coward. Um, he, he's easily scared, easily frightened, and he does work up the courage, obviously, to do his do what he needs to do. But when I really looked at it, I'm like, Luigi's kind of hard to place. Like, really hard to place. I did the best I could, though. So, and I always like to present at least two options. If there are more, then, you know, there are more. But here are my two theories, anyway, to what Lanticore he belongs to do. The first one, I mean, uh, it's a cop out more because of the color and because he's the hero of his story usually. But it's the, gr but it's uh, one second. There you go. It's the Green Lantern Corps. Um, yeah, kind of a cop out because of his color co coloring and he's a hero in his own stories. But I mean, it does make some sense because you do need courage and will to overcome your fear or fear to do your job and all that. The even if he could acquire a Green Lantern ring, not necessarily saying he could, uh, I don't think he'd maintain it very, uh, hold on to it very much, because he's a guy who gets easily scared, like easily scared. Uh, so I, I just don't see him holding on to a Green Lantern ring very long, but I don't, that's not saying he couldn't have one. I had to go through all of them, like, ugh, he doesn't really fit for rage. Uh, he doesn't really care that he lives in his brother's shadow, though. I mean, even if he does, he doesn't really show rage about it. So, rage is out. He doesn't strike fear into most people. Even the ghosts he fights aren't really that afraid of him, and like we just mentioned. So, fear's out of there. Love? I don't know if he's in love with anyone. That's the, I don't know a huge amount of Luigi's character in terms of that. If he is in love with someone, I don't know if that's what fuels him, either. Because it's never really shown if love's what driving him or not. So, I couldn't go with love. Hope? Unfortunately, fear is kind of an enemy of hope, and he's clearly afraid half the time. So, at best, he hopes to get the hell out of there. Uh, death, obviously, isn't going to work. Life, he's alive, but I don't know if we can count him, like, living to the fullest or anything like that. The only other Lantern Corps I could really figure out was compassion. And that's only because he's always there to lend a hand, which is a very compassionate thing to do, really. Uh, the fact of the matter is, no matter how scared he is, he's always there to, you know, help Mario out when he really needs them, even though he's... Like I said, a coward, uh, which does show compassion towards his brother and other people who need help. So in that regard, yes, I think compassion actually wouldn't be the worst candidate for him. Uh, remember, you either, either needs to be your dominant emotion or you need to have zero compassion in order to qualify for the Indigo League. So I, I say compassion is not a bad option. Uh, this is a short video because, frankly, I didn't have much to say on Luigi. But yeah, I'd, I'd probably say compassion wouldn't be a bad uh, idea. So let me know what you think. Uh, do you think Luigi's Green Lantern, Indigo Lantern, or any one of the other in seven? Uh, let me know in the comments below. But thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Like, comment, share, subscribe. I'll see you next time. Uh, it'll be another Zendikar video. And uh, What If will be on Wednesday. So thanks for watching. See you later.